the Colorado mountains are making their usual breathtaking transition into the winter season despite the warmer than normal weather and very little snow so far. This year Mother Nature has not really blessed us with uh, any natural to start little bits and pieces which help freeze up our ground. However, the snow cannons on the ski hills are still making quality man-made snow because it's actually something called the wet bulb temperature that really matters. It accounts for evaporative cooling in the dry Colorado air. Perfect example here, Wednesday morning, it's almost 10 o'clock and the sun is shining bright here at Copper Mountain. The air temperature is up to 36 degrees, well warmer than the freezing point for water, and yet they are still turning water into snow because the relative humidity is only 46%, which makes the wet bulb temperature 28.7. Still plenty of time to make some snow. Oh yeah. What uh, the wet bulb is pretty much all we care about. We're watching forecasts. That's the first thing I do every morning when I wake up, even before I come into work. Stephen Madonna is a snowmaker at Copper Mountain. We're pushing it as hard as we can, really. They've got 75 snow guns working at least 12 hours a day. Definitely gets everyone ramped up when we turn all of our snow guns on. In addition to a public opening, Copper Mountain is hosting its first ever World Cup event on Thanksgiving weekend. Trying to get the racers on snow, trying to get the athletes training before they have any of their big competitions like that. Copper Mountain is targeting a public opening on November 7th. Colorado is famous for having several ski areas open before Thanksgiving. Thanks mostly to our cold, dry air and our favorable wet bulb temperatures. Uh, I think snowmaking is probably the only reason you have skiing before the holidays or within the holidays in Colorado. Meteorologist Corey Reppenhagen for the Nine News Weather Impact Team. So the storm coming in tomorrow will actually raise the humidity, making the snowmaking less efficient. Hmm. However, Right after the storm clears, uh, they could actually see ideal snowmaking wet bulbs in the teens. <laughs> it's a new term. Yeah, throw that one out at the dinner table and say, <laughs> all right, who knows what a wet bulb temperature is? Nobody yeah. is. Corey just educated us. Yeah. I've never heard the term before. It matters. Yeah, yeah it does. And That's actually all they care about, he said. Snowmaking is everything you got to do right now. You got to be first and among the first or something.